we are back from another project in our homeschooling that Kids Questions 101. Alam naman natin that we've been through a lot this pandemic. And today, we're still in lockdown. There's one thing that did change. Our homeschooling is still ongoing and didn't get affected. So we are enjoying our studies and nothing to adjust at all. Knowledge and understanding keeps coming as we answer all your questions. Today, we have another kid's question for you. What are the most giveaway items this pandemic? Ano po yung mostly given as a help from LGU from the private group to support people in this pandemic? Do you have an answer? Ate, do you know the answer? My answer is my answer is like rubbing alcohol or mask. Oh yeah. Also, it's also right. But in terms of food, what do you think is given away? So kids, what do you think is the answer? What do you think is your answer, Atilia? My answer is sardines. Oh yeah, if your answer is sardines, yes, you are correct. Sardines have been given to many households this pandemic. See, sir. And yeah. sardines <laughs> manufacture produce hundreds of cans daily. Yeah. Anyway, what are sardines, by the way? What kind of fish do they use to produce sardines? Let's watch this. Here in the Philippines, Zamboanga is the most great producer of sardines in the country. Legal and Mega Sardines donated their entire 2020 advertising budget for COVID-19 aid and relief. Sardines and filchard are common names that refer to various small oily forage fish in the Hearing family of Clopidea. The term sardine was first used in English during the early 15th century and may come from and may come from the Mediterranean island of Sardinia, around which sardines were once abundant. I have a question for you. What kind of fish is used to make sardines? So Ate so, ate, they are small, silvery, elongated fish with a single short dorsal fin, no lateral line, and no scales on the head. They range in length from about 15 to 30 centimeters and live in dense schools, migranting along the coast and feeding on plankton, of which they consume vast quantities. Sardines are used commercially fished for a variety of use. 
How to produce it includes first, date, imitate consumption, tanning, drying, salting, smoking, and reduction into fish meal or fish oil. So, Ate, what element contains in sardines? It contains proteins, calcium, copper, and vitamins. That means it's good for our health. Yeah. Can you lose weight by eating sardines? Okay, Ate. First of all, makes you full and help stimulate metabolism. I have another question for you, Ella. Mm -mm. Who invented sardines? So, Ate, the person who invented sardines is Nicholas Apert. Tanning is a relatively recent innovation in the big picture of history. Up until about 200 years ago, there were no tin sardines. This changed in the early 19th century. Nicolas Appert, a Frenchman from the Champagne region, started his career as a professional cook. Wow, Ella, that's good. But anyway, do you know how to make sardines? Oh, okay, Ate. Actually, we also had the research, so yeah, I think I can. So, Ativia. Do you know what brand of sardines is the healthiest? That's my question. Okay, our top best can recommendation for sardines. What? Nigo sardines in tomato sauce with chili added. Two, King Oscar sardines, extra virgin. Three, Wild Planet. Wild sardines and extra virgin olive oil, lightly smoked. 4. Nori Portuguese sardines, spiced in pure olive oil. 5. Seasoned sardines in pure olive oil. So, Ate, do you notice they all have olive oil? Yes, because I'm the one who made it. Yeah! <laughs> and that's why actually, olive oil, it's also healthy for our body. So yeah, Ate. I also have one question. How many cans of sardines can I eat a day? Eating five cans of sardines every day, that's just one of the things that Craig Copper recommends. According to Cooper, sardines are the number one superfood. They're are a powerhouse of nutrition. So I'm kind of an evangelist for sardines amongst everyone I meet. Granted, sardines are good for you. So, Ativia, I have another question. What country eats the most sardines? Portugal. They are referring to fish. They are referring to fresh, succulent sardines. The bigger, the fatter, the better. 12 pounds a person on average compared to only 2 persons of the fish can. So there's many kind of dishes that we can do with sardines because our dad really cooked sardines yeah. very much. Yeah, and, and I also really like it. And also, you can make many dishes with... Here's a 24 menu that we will give you about sardines. Here's the number one, Ella. Sardines with miswa. Sardines with miswa and pakal. Sardines with miswa, <laughs> miswa and upo. Ginsang sardinas at upo. Ginisang sardinas at sayote. Ginisang sardinas at pecha. Ginisang sardinas at talbos ng kamate. Ginisang sardinas in propolio. Ginisang sardinas at langka. 
Ginisang papaya with sardina. Ginisang papaya with <laughs> fritters. <laughs> sardinas fritters. Or have you tasted this, Ella? Sardinas fritters. How about lumpiang ano? Sardina. Maybe. I don't know. But have you tasted sardinas fish balls? Uh, tagal na ako hindi nakasakay ng fish balls. Eh. Mm, yeah. But here's another one for you, Ate Bia. How about sisig sardina? Yes. Sir Shadow sardinas with ampalaya. We taste that already, right? Yeah. We ate that. How about tartong sardina? Hmm. Tartong sardinas? Um, or pancit sardinas? Oh. How we taste udon? Mm, I don't know what's udon, but I think it's also food. <laughs> or sardinas fried rice. Sardinas, ano? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Sardinas pasta. Hmm. Or sardinas burger. Oh, <gasps> there's something <laughs> like that. I don't know. There's sardinas, sardinas pandesal. Palaman mo lang. Hmm. Or tinigang na sardinas. Okay. Mayon yun know? Mayon ganon atibia. And I think yah, ang dami na rin, no? Yeah, and there's many, many more to come, maybe, that other chefs will make their own dish. Yeah, you can sardinas. also be creative. Baka sardinas pizza pa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 yes, yeah, sardinas na pizza. That will be, I don't know what will that taste. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe on our channel. Bye! Bye! And see you soon! Always remember that knowledge is power! power.